What separates a high-performance SUV from simply a sporty one? Well, for one, you need a big engine, preferably a supercharged or turbocharged V8. You also need good looks, bigger brakes, and maybe a nice exhaust note. The Jaguar F-Pace SVR has all of that and then some. Just look at it. There's a supercharged V8 under the hood from the F-Type SVR that produces 541 horsepower. Those big Brembo brakes are 15 and a half inches up front and 15.6 inches out back. And not to mention, like any good Jag, it has a really good exhaust note. Even by looking at the stat sheet, you know that the Jaguar F-Pace SVR is something special. It's the quickest, most powerful SUV the company has ever built. To 60, it takes just 4.1 seconds, and it goes on to a top speed of 175 miles per hour thanks to the 5-liter supercharged V8 that produces 541 horsepower. But you don't get the whole picture on paper. You really have to drive it to experience how crazy this SUV is. What you don't see when looking at the stat sheet is the suspension. It's 30% stiffer than the base f pace and a 5% reduction in body roll means you can toss it into a corner like an F-Type. And then there's all-wheel drive. A lot of performance SUVs in this segment do offer all-wheel drive, but Jags is a little different. It sends up to 100% of the power to the rear wheels at once, with no more than 50% sent to the front wheels. So it's a rear-wheel drive bias SUV. All that power is managed via an 8-speed automatic transmission, and for the most part, it's a really good gearbox. If you're in normal or eco mode, it just shifts normally without hesitation. If you're in dynamic mode, it's much quicker, and you can use the paddle shifter to do it yourself. In dynamic mode, the F-Pace SVR is a beast. The engine is powerful, the steering is tight and responsive, and the chassis really holds the car firmly in the corners. But the good thing is, if you just want to drive it like a normal SUV, you can. If you pop it into normal or eco mode, the engine quiets down a little bit, the steering is a little softer, and it just feels great. The only thing I will say is that the suspension, no matter which mode you're in, is a little harsh. So if you can deal with that, it's a perfect all-around SUV. If we had to dock the F-Pace SVR anywhere, it'd be the infotainment. While the XE and the I-Pace have the new dual touchscreen setup, which is fine for the most part, this one still carries over the old system, and it looks dated compared to the other setup. It's ridiculous, really, that the Jaguar F-Pace SVR is this good with just a few tweaks. The 5-liter supercharged V8 gives it tons of power, and the big Brembos up front and back give it plenty of stoppage, too. The suspension, meanwhile, transforms this tall riding SUV into a low-slung sports car in spirit. At $80,000, it ain't cheap, but you're definitely going to love what you pay for.